you know, why did you want to get it over with? Uh, the reason why I wanted to get over with is because me and my family have been talking for a while about Rutgers and Penn State, but I just felt like Penn State was home, man. It was, it's just a great place. The recruits, we all get along. I always talk to them a lot Appreciate and you. just put my number in Juwan's phone. And it's just, I just love this place, the whole coaching staff. It's just a great place. Who have you become closest with as far as the other commits? Like, who are the couple of guys you've been talking to? Uh, Shaquan, Juwan, uh, and probably Jarvis. Okay, cool. Uh, Coach Donovan, I saw you talking to him a little bit ago. What's your relationship like with him? Are you talking more to Coach Smith? Who, who have you been talking with most? I talk to mostly everybody. I talk to Coach Donovan, Coach Smith, Coach Shoup, and uh, Coach Franklin. And then, and then finally, last thing, I mean, yeah, how much recruiting are you going to do? Obviously, Franklin loves when you guys are reaching out to other guys. I saw you talking to Miles earlier. Are you going to be uh, one of those guys contacting other guys, or are you going to be laying low, letting everybody do their own thing? Yeah, I'm whatever coach needs me to do from a recruiting standpoint, I'll do, because I'm here to help the team and just come in and just do it. When did you make up your mind? Was it just today or last couple days? No, it's, it really came down Monday when uh, my parents, we sat down at the dinner table and just talked about college recruiting, and I told them that I really, I really want to go to Penn State, and they said, let's do it, and then I said, all right, sign me up for the Penn State camp. I'll do it there. And then here we are today. It's just a great, overwhelming decision and really emotional when I was in there. It's just great. So did you actually commit to them today? On What was the, what was their reaction when you? Uh, well, Coach, Coach Franklin, he said, once you commit to me, we're engaged. So I'm engaged <laughs> right now. So it's great. Uh, he said, once you shake my hand, all, all the recruiting is over. So it's over. I shook his hand. I'm a man of my word. It's over. And I'm just happy to be a part of the VR family. The ability to do it in person. A lot of kids don't necessarily do that, but to look somebody in their eye, in their eye, and give them the word. How important was that to you? Because obviously you made up your, your decision a little earlier. You decided to wait till today. Yeah, it really, it really is exciting because then you can see somebody's facial expressions and see how happy they are to have you on board. And that's what really got me really happy because as soon as I said um, I, I want to be a part of the VR family, he just. His smile just came out. It was just great having a uh, head coach like that. It's great. Where do you see yourself fitting in at Penn State? Yeah, um, I know you have a, a ways to go yet before you get here. Yeah. But. Uh, I can see myself as a, a corner, corner or a nickel, nickel back. So hopefully, come in and I play early because that's what he, that's what he preaches. He playing early because they don't have a lot of scholarships. So I got to take advantage of my opportunity. What does the rest of the summer hold for you? And how much is it? Does it help to get this kind of pressure off of you to focus on your senior season? Uh, it, it really does. That's that's what really pushed me. Uh, I really wanted to get this over before school started again and before actual football practices started. So I love the date I picked. This is a great day. It was beautiful when I was saying it. So, And it just means a lot to me. My coaching staff, my friends at home, family. It's just, it's just amazing. What uh, sort of reaction have you gotten from friends and stuff? I know, oh. Have you been able to gauge that yet? I know it's yeah. Kinda... Like I was on Twitter, and as soon as I did it, like five minutes later, I went from 991 followers to 1,100. <laughs> it's just great having all the, te the spotlight on me real for a little bit, and it's just great. And all my friends been posting on Instagram. Congratulations to my my bro, my cousin, all this uh, on committing to Penn State. What was it like for you today, getting a chance to work with Coach Shoop a little bit? What, what kind of takeaway did you get from Bob? Uh, he, he's just a great guy, mm -hmm. a great defensive coordinator. He, he knows he knows how to the game of football, and he's just they're just going in the right direction and everything. He's really coaching them up. Really, he's not a hard nosed guy, but he you know when he he wants his point across and everything. So yeah. I love that kind of coaching staff. This the defensive back coaching staff is just great. Mm -hmm. I love it. And did James just smile today? I know with some of the guys, he like pushed Adam McLean to the floor when he committed. I mean, did you do anything crazy like that, or was he just nah, he, a little mellow? Yeah, it was like a real hard handshake. It's like, <laughs> oh, he like grabbed my hand so hard. I'm like, yes. Uh, and then we just hugged, hugged, and I knew, I knew it was good from there. Uh, I really love this coaching staff. It's great. Mm -hmm.